What is up everybody? What's going on? How is everyone doing? Excellent. Excellent. What's going on? What's up? How are you? Cool. Anyways, as you may have noticed, I am not riding my Harley Breakout at the moment. No, no. What we have here, what we have here is a 2005 Harley Davidson Sportster 1200 Custom. Ooh, ah, party. You may be asking yourself several questions at the moment. Why are you on this bike? What's up? What's uh, what's going on? What happens to your breakout? Nothing to break out. The breakout's just fine. But uh, why is he in the middle of the street there? I okay. Um, yeah, but uh, the story. Okay. Nice. Here's the story behind this one. Oh, I wish I had my breakout. Oh, I wish. What are you doing? Ah. Uh, that would have rev bombed her. You just stand in the middle of the street. Can't wait. Anyways. Yeah, that guy he just. He went past the stop sign without looking. He didn't see me. I was going slow enough. I mean. That's why you don't go too fast on these kinds of streets, but. He didn't see me. Then he, he's, he's like in his own little world. I don't care what's going on around me. Screw the other drivers. So, uh, where, where, I forgot what I was saying. I totally forgot. Yeah, this is a uh, 05 Sportster 1200 Custom. Let's get the whole, uh, the whole model out of the way. And, uh, basically, like I said, the breakout's just fun. The breakout's in the, uh, the garage right now. Uh, I got this bike for a steal. It was ridiculously cheap. That guy wants to get rid of it. It's not stolen. It's totally legit. It got the title and everything. Don't think that. That was like everyone's first thought. That was my first thought too. But uh, yeah, he just needed the money and uh, I guess my gain, right? So uh, yeah, it was too good to pass up, so I bought it. And uh, what I really want to do with it is just completely make it my own. Like, make it look like nobody else's sportster out there. I mean, you're gonna, you're gonna get a lot of it's gonna look similar, but it's, it's gonna be mine, you know? It's gonna be all my own stuff and, and everything, and it's gonna be my new project. And uh, I plan on videoing it, videoing everything, and, and putting it up, and everything I did to it, and everything that's gonna go on to it, and all the stuff and if you want to complain and yell at me that that's not the right way to do stuff you can do that and and enjoy it that's basically what I want to do with it and it's not going to take a it's not going to be a, a short thing it's going to take a while it's it's I mean uh, my goal is to have it done within this down shit there my goal is to have it done within maybe say two years it's going to be a really short process it's whenever I have extra funds to, to buy parts for the bike is, is when it's gonna get parts, you know? I mean, there's stuff I wanna do to it. I wanna add some parts, take some parts that are, that are off, that are on here right now, I want to get them off. And uh, paint and just completely make it my own. A little Z special. So yeah, that was, that was the project I was talking about in my other video. And I look forward to it. It's going to be good times. Good times. Yeah, the bike. The bike runs great as is. I just rode it. Put it up for a tune-up. No oil. Have everything just adjusted and tightened and and. Uh, Make sure it's in tip-top shape. I feel used to the carburetor a little bit. It's not fuel injected. It's it's a, it's a carburetor, which is kind of cool. And yeah, that's basically that's about it. 
What else can you say about it? This is just the uh, introduction to it. Ripping up roads everywhere, everywhere. If you guys have any ideas on uh, what to put on here to make it like a, what, what kind of look I'm going for is like a kind of a choppery, I mean, it's more of a bobber kind of look because I'm not really chopping anything, but it's, if you have any ideas on, on what to, what to put on it, leave it in the comments, take a look. There's still a lot of stuff that I'm debating on whether to do or not, whether to, to completely convert it to a hardtail. I mean, cause that's just an awesome, an awesome look right there. Definitely want to put apes on it. Not too high. Like mini apes or something. But it's going to be a great learning experience. Going to get, get to work on a bike. It should be fun to take you guys along with me. I'm just rambling now. That's basically what I'm doing. Uh, in a second, I'll get, I'll get off the bike and show you exactly what I'm... The starting canvas, the before picture, if you will. And that's basically going to be it, so... Yeah. Get ready for that. So, anyways, I'm going to cut to the, uh, the walk around of it. And then next time, we're going to be taking this bad boy apart. See you guys later.